Hey friends, happy Friday. Welcome back to the channel, Creating with Sarah. Thanks so much for popping on another fun planner video with me today. So today is day three of 12 days of planner D stash. Welcome to my planner studio space. This is the back portion of my studio. It's like an opened um, upstairs area. So <laughs> you can hear everything. Anyways, I'm a little festive today. My hat, not in frame, but it's super cute. So I'm gonna pretend I'm an elf today and I'm gonna come in here and help this girl out and declutter some stuff. <laughs> so back here, what I talk about all the time behind my desk, I have like this small, very old Ikea desk. It's very old, I really need to get rid of it. Um, so you see my happy planner, like where does my arm go? Right here, it's these sticker books, the organizers. The sticker books right there, we're gonna go through and de-stash some of those, so let's get to it. Okay, here we go. So I'm gonna try to cut down this video because the other one was a little bit longer. Um, I'm thinking this may be a little bit longer because this is a lot to go through, but I have these categorized and I've been putting post-its around my office so I know what day I'm on. <laughs> um and making sure that i have 12 spaces to declutter um let me know in the comments down below if you've been doing this with me and how does it feel to let things go and what have you let go put it in the comments down below okay so this is categorized by my favorites and any new sticker books that i have recently got i would put in here um this is categorized what i call my functional everyday like mom um, or school related sticker books. And then this is um, functional stickers. So it's like um, alphabet stickers, uh, there's journaling, there's dates and holidays, um, there's the skinny happy planner small books in the back. So that's how I categorize these. I've always categorized my sticker books. It just helps me find where everything is. Okay, so let's go through favorites. This one might be a hard one because they're all my favorites and they're new. So we have Modern Meow, which I'm gonna keep that one. Um, we have Mary Boo Designs. This is a newer one. I'm gonna keep this one and use it for the new year because I haven't had a chance to plan with that one. We have um, the Butterfly one. Um, this is new. I'm gonna keep this one. Let's see, we have um, Stick Babe Essentials. I really like this one, so I'm gonna keep that one. Again, this one's gonna be hard. Um, Tiny, this is one of my ultimate oldie favorites from you know when Happy Planner was 365. It has all the cute icons, love it. I, ha I think I have two of those. Um, Live Sub Party, this was my um, coming back to Happy Planner before Squad uh, Planner. It was called Live Sub Party. It was a vertical lined planner and they have the sticker book and it was just adorable. So I think I have the big as well that I got at the warehouse sale, but I'm gonna keep that. Uh, we have two planner babes. So I have the classic and mini, which I'm probably gonna keep because then I have one accessory book. Um, great collection. So here's my other tiny, I'm gonna keep that one. Squad life, um, I really don't use this one. Let me know in the comments down below which one was your favorite out of all the squad. Um, I feel like I use both squad goals. <laughs> the newer one and then the old one. And actually I'm missing one. I know there's like another one that's got like purple or teal on it. I don't have that one at all. But I'm totally keeping the squad goals. Like this one, I don't know, maybe I could get this one away. But I really love the seasonal touch to it. So I don't know. I'm gonna keep that one. Again, this one's gonna be hard. Oh, I actually have two, so maybe I can give one away. I know I have a lot of squad goals as well. So we'll see how many backups I have and maybe we'll give one away. Okay, Encourager, the mini. I think this is the only one I have from Encourager, so I'm gonna keep that one. Um, I got that being on squad. Another Life's a Party, one of my ultimate favorites with neon lights. <laughs> Uh, another squad goal. So yeah, I mean, we'll go through those. I don't need that many. I think I got those because my Michaels um, put those on clearance so they don't have many more. Uh, neon lights, one of my ultimate favorites. That's a backup I'm keeping. Empowering women. This was a great one. It has lots of good quotes. Really like this one. Uh, I'm going to keep that one. 
Pastel Rainbow. Yes. I'm going to keep that one. Okay. Um, squad Goal in the Mini. So I have it in the Accessory Book, Classic, and Mini. And Petite stickers. Watercolor Goals. This was a fun one. I really like this one. So these are all my favorites. Um, emoji. <laughs> I love using emojis, so I'm going to keep that one. So out of this one, my goal is to get rid of some of the squad goal and life because I don't need duplicates. Okay, next up is like my mom everyday essential sticker books. Let's see what I can get rid of in here. So essential planning. I really like that one, but I may have two of that one. Super mom, definitely keeping. That's like my one of my ultimate favorites. Um, nurse, this is very functional. I only have one of these, so I'm gonna keep that one. Essential planning, gonna, uh, go through those and see which one I want to de-stash. This is teacher, this is like a seasonal one. Um, I kind of like some, having some school related stuff because my kids are still in school. But they're getting older. Oh my gosh. My oldest is going to graduate soon. No, don't, please. <laughs> okay, um, so I'm going to put this one to the side. So that may be a maybe. And then seasonal type. This is a newer one. This is for a big, and it has a lot of seasonal stuff. We'll see about that. Student. Oh, this is a cool one. This is a cool one. Try to do this with one hand. This is kind of a brand new one too. This is one of my fun ones that I do like to use when back to school comes around. Maybe I'll keep that one. Uh, planner Basics. This is a really great functional one. This is when you think about Happy Planner, this is what you think about. These colors, um, functional stickers. So I'm gonna keep that one. Mom. Keeping planner basic in the mini, keeping bookish. I really love bookish. I'm gonna keep that one. Um, oh, I have another mom one. This is in the mini. I guess I have oh, one in the classic. Okay, cool. So I'm gonna keep that one. So I have one of each. Playful icons. You know what? I have two of these, so I can definitely give one of these away. Yeah, okay, cool. So we'll keep one and maybe give one. Foodie, I really like this one. I don't think you can get these anymore, so I'm gonna keep that one. So yeah, I have like food in here for like recipes, if I wanna sit down and do recipes. So I'm gonna keep these, because um, I don't have a huge selection of these types of sticker books, so I'm keeping those. Uh, let's see budget. I think this is the only budget besides the um, Agenda 52 stickers. I Really wish happy planner would come out with more colorful stickers. That's not budget related I I don't know if this was supposed to be like a theme of be happy and celebrate about budgeting it's a cute concept, but <laughs> I Do think people don't need this this color to get into budget because I know a lot of planners love budgeting as one of their focus planning. Um, so I don't know. I just wish Happy Planner would come out with these colors, but in other sticker books. Okay, let's see. Books are magic. This is the other type of bookish sticker book. So I want to keep that one because again, I want to have something for back to school. So here's my other playful icons. You could only get this one at Target. And I, I got another one. Let me set these books off to the side because I don't want this to fall. So we have Happy in Action. I'm gonna keep that one. That's a really great one. Um, bold, Bold School. Whoa. Um, I don't know about this one. I don't know do today. I really like the leopard and the coat and the, the boxes. I may keep that one. Okay. Student. Oh, ultimate favorite student sticker book. This one was my favorite. I actually got two of those when that came out. Here's the other one. It's just very cute. Oh my gosh. 
Lots of um, deco stickers in that one. Cool to be kind. Um, I don't know. Maybe I could get rid of this one. I don't really use this one too much. I thought I would. I don't know. This one, this, this section here to these sash is going to be very hard. <laughs> um, students, this is another cute one. Lots of deco. I don't know. I really like this one too. Um, teacher icon. This is a cute one too. I love that one. And then this student one. This is more like seasonal. Maybe I can let go of this one. So I'm going to go through the student ones and see which ones I can really just let go and I don't need what I've decided so far. Um, I have a lot of these squad goals. I think I have like three of these and then possibly three of the squad life. So I don't need that many duplicates. So I'm definitely giving away one of each. And then I have two essential planning. So I'm going to give away this one, but I think there's stickers missing out of here because it's a little bit thinner. Um, but I don't need both. So I'm going to de-stash that one. And then I have this student one, 577. I think I can let this one go. I think it'll be all right um, because I do have all these other students that I kept and I also decided just to keep both playful icons, the book from Target. So that's good. I don't wanna feel pressured like I have to. I just wanna let things go that I think I can. And that's the whole process of this. If I could at least just get rid of one or two things, I'm happy. So that's the goal. So, so far I have four books here that I can let go. And then the nurse one, I'm gonna just put my wellness uh, portion of stickers, fitness and wellness, which is a section that I'm trying to go through as well. I think that's like day seven. So I'm just gonna go put that over there. Um, but let's focus on this last portion here. Okay, so Agenda 52. This is a newer one. This is like an essential sticker book. I just got this. So I'm going to keep that. Um, fun alphabets. I don't really use alphabets a whole lot in my plans with me's or just, I just don't. But I'm going to keep that because I don't have that many. Uh, the Mambi sticks. I really like those. I've had um, those for a while. I have black and gold. The black is my favorite. Um, Dates and holidays. I'm going to keep this one because it's an essential. Journaling. These are my ultimate favorites. I really like the icons in this one and the boxes. And then I think I love the fitness ones in here. Just, oh, and the arrows. I just love that. So I'm going to keep those. This is the old alphabet one. Keeping. So next up is journaling doodles. Uh, I really want to use this more, so maybe I'll pull this more and shop my stash. But I think I'm going to keep that one. Colorful boxes. This one's a fun one. And it has a lot of great boxes. And I like to... I like to do sticker combos. And I think this goes with, like, some of the other sticker books that I have. Uh, Mega stickers. These are Joann's. It was in a kit a long time ago. And I love these. These are also those stickers that any, anytime I think of like old happy planner, I think of these because of the colorful. Oh, and they don't even have the thing on the back. But I got two of those. Uh, colorful boxes. <laughs> Everybody's favorite. Um, I don't pull these a whole lot. I just have them here because I need them. Again, this is what this section's for. So I want to kind of go through these and see if I could possibly get rid of one of those. Um, oh my gosh, guys. This was my first ever sticker book by Happy Planner. 1486. It's very functional. Again, one of the colors that... Actually, this these colors remind me of Mambi when they have like the scrapbooking stuff. Um, I have like some... I have like a kit that kind of looks like these colors. So I'm going to keep that one journaling doodles oh since I have two I can probably give one of those away I don't need both I don't think alphabets I have two of those so I'm gonna save that okay last little bit let's see my wrong wrong stickers 
um, every day. Oh my gosh, I haven't even used these. So I'm keeping that, keeping wrong, wrong. Um, this is actually a second pack. So I have that one. Merry Christmas holiday one. That's cute. Oh yeah, here's my other one. I could flip through. I do love the tie-dye. Um, oh, I have two of these. I think what got me is, uh, I remember Hobby Lobby had a clearance and I grabbed those. Oh, this is the Mambi stick one. Wrong, wrong. I love that. Okay. Empowering women. Love the quotes in here. Be happy box. This was my ultimate favorite be happy box. I mean, I love it. <laughs> I love those stickers. Oh, here's an old one. This one I could de-stash. We'll de-stash that one. Ooh, I love this one. This has more color to it. I love this wrong one. One that has more color to it. Uh, this is the fitness one. This should go in my other box. I'm going to keep that one, but I'm going to put it where it goes. Oh, I have two of these. Again, it was probably because of Hobby Lobby. Uh, be happy box. I actually I have two um, because um, I think when we were on squad they all got one and then I went to the party and we got one. So I have two of those. Vintage botanicals. I could de de stash this one. Yeah, maybe this one. Oh, I love this one. Even though this was a uh, Walmart exclusive, it does have fun colors in it. I'll have to look through that one and see what we got. Okay, teacher stuff. These are great for decorating the monthlies. Mm, maybe. Oh, this is icons. getting hard jungle vibes I love jungle vibes okay another teacher one I have two of these again it's probably because of Hobby Lobby so I can give away one and then another seasonal one sorry if you can hear my neighbor's dog I mean I don't know why I'm apologizing dogs bark you can't help it <laughs> the sticker books that I know that I can let go um, so I have squad life squad goals essential planning student life um, one of my colorful boxes, and then three of the smaller sticker packs from Happy Planner uh, Vintage Botanicals. This is quotes, and this is a seasonal teacher one. So for day three, I got rid of one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight stickers or eight things. I think I'm doing really good. And again, when you go through your stuff, even if it's just one thing, just make sure that in your heart you feel like, I can let this go. I don't need this in my collection. I, I can let this go. So that is my tip for today. I hope you guys have enjoyed this um, de-stashing, 12 days of de-stashing. And thank you so much for watching. And be sure to share this if you think someone else may benefit from this video. And I will see you all in the next one. Take care, stay safe, and Merry Christmas. Bye!